This is a short video on how we do our freestyle jigs. We've never done this mold, so it should be exciting. First, we put all our hardware in the mold. It's kind of hard when you have shaky hands like I do, so it's good if you don't have shaky hands. But if you do have shaky hands, just take your time, get them in there, get them all straight, make sure that it's all centered. After we got our hooks in the mold and got our wire keeper, then we close up the mold. And it's ready for hot lead. We pour hot lead into the molds. We're gonna let that cool off. All right, it's time to demold. Looking good. Let's make some more. Check it out. All right, folks, that's how they look after they come out of the mold and they're ready to go and they're ready to get powder coated and they're ready to be uh, painted and put eyes on them. They're gonna come in packs of two. I'm gonna have them up on the website. They are a three out hook, a two out hook, and a one out hook. Let's go ahead and get them powder coated. We heat them up real good with the heat gun. Then you just dip them in the powder paint. Just like that. Knock off the excess. And we're good to go. Wait for it to cool, put it down to the side. Before we put them in the oven, we're gonna break off all the uh, hook eyes to make sure there's holes there. Cause some of them when they dry up, it covers the hook eye. We can get that before we put it in the oven and harden it. See like this one here, we gotta take it and bust out the hook eye. That's basically all we're doing. Move it up real good. And drop it in the powder paint. That's how we do it. All right, guys, this is what it looks like when they're done and out of the oven. They're nice and cured now. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna glue some eyes on. And guys, I got a bunch of different eyes. Let me show you. A couple different sizes, couple different eyes. Different ones to choose from. I don't know which one I'm gonna go with yet just yet but got a ton of different ones I think I like these chartreuse ones I think I'm gonna go with these and if I run out I'll go with a different color all right guys stick these eyes on they have an adhesive back you just want to put them on there and stick them once you stick them you want to dab them with a little bit of epoxy And that one's on there forever. Then I'm gonna go ahead and do it the other side. Stuck it on there. Dab of epoxy. And then you let it cure. Put my stuff on the wheel. It's made by Flex Coat. That's where I got it from. I'll link it in the description and uh, it's a really cool tool it spins real slow lets the epoxy cure and uh, all my baits end up curing pretty good pretty solid you use it for crank baits but you can use it for jigs too and so it just takes I think two double A's or two triple A's and it lasts forever I forgot the last time I've changed the battery on it so I'll let these cure and I'll show you what it looks like after this. So there you go folks. It's the Do It Freestyle Jig Mold. Here's one with a red eye and one with a chartreuse eye. I thought it came out pretty good. 
is basically a pill sized jig head with a hook keeper it's got a good little hook keeper there for your swim baits put your swim bait on there you're good to go look at that what bass is not going to want to bite that that's a nice bait right there the videos on the screen are what YouTube thinks you should watch. Tell me what you guys think. I'm JQ from OnlyFans Bass Fishing, Oklahoma. I'll catch you on the next one.